Welcome back. Beginning today, all you need to get away is a reservation and a tent. State campgrounds opened up last week, but only for people with RVs. Today, just a few hours from now, the parks will finally allow tent campers to return. Channel 3's Roger Suzanne and joined us live now outside Hammond Asset State Park in Madison. Roger, for those families who want to pack up and unplug, what do they need to know? Well, Nicole and Eric, yeah, the big thing you mentioned, they got to get a reservation. And also, they need to know they're not allowed to invite guests. And here at Hammond Asset, the park does not officially open until 8 o'clock, but for all of you tent campers, yes, there is finally some hope on the horizon. You can see there the signs directing campers to, I don't know, maybe their little version of paradise. And again, beginning today, all you got to do is follow this sign, bring a tent, and unwind. At long last, Jen Iacone and her niece Ellie are back in their happy place. Oh, we relax, we hang out. It's a community. Everybody um, kind of knows each other here. Um, everyone's here every summer. So we are so happy that it opened. Jen and her family have been camping here at Hammond Asset State Park every summer for decades. But this season, their vacation was delayed because of COVID-19. Campers here and at Rocky Neck State Park in Niantic told us it felt like their entire summer hung in the balance. It was kind of up in the air the whole time, right to the last couple days, you know, because they weren't kind of sure what they were going to do. State campgrounds finally opened up to folks with RVs and trailers last week. After the summer we've all been experiencing, being able to unplug meant everything. I just love the, the people here. Everyone's so friendly. I mean, everyone you walk by says hello, good morning. Um, it's just gorgeous, the whole atmosphere, and um, I can't go a summer without coming here. Now, even more people will be able to enjoy our state parks. Tent campers are invited back as long as they make a reservation first and pledge not to invite visitors. Only registered campers are allowed. Back at her campsite, Jen is just glad more people can unwind at Connecticut's beautiful state campgrounds. Calm and it's um, peaceful. Uh, go for walks, and we spend a lot of time with our families. Um, so we look forward to it all year. It's the week we char recharge our batteries. Uh, and back live now. I got to tell you, my version of camping, I think, is going without cable for the weekend. I'm just saying. But listen, a lot of people certainly love it. And I've got more great news for campers of all stripes, including you RVers. The bathrooms at State Park Campgrounds are also going to open today. So again, a big day for tent campers and really any other type of camper here at Hammond Asset and all the other state campgrounds. Reporting live in Madison this morning, I'm Roger Suzanne, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.